What is up, guys? I'm in my hometown and I think I would not be able to like talk as freely as I talk in all my videos, so please don't mind me. Today we are going to be doing summer friendly makeup. Like I don't know what is a summer friendly makeup. Like I seriously don't know. Summer is not meant to be friendly in India. Here we go. I must still share some tips and tricks that I do to like save my makeup off. And please do not mind my dark circles. Please do not mind my skin right now because it's a little bit hairy here and there because I am I cannot use blade in this part of my face right now because yeah that incident happened to me I'm like super close to the camera and like the lighting is also like super duper good in here so you'll be able to see through my soul my pores my darkness my light whatever shit everything it's humid as fuck so we're gonna try doing like a humid friendly makeup okay so right now i have nothing on my face that humid in here like oh my god i have no idea how am i supposed to like put my makeup on right now because there's no ac room first the trick that i use when i'm here well i drench my face with setting spray and let it dry on its own completely soaked into your skin I'm going to use my primer I'm only gonna use it where i think my makeup is gonna budge for foundation always go for like a matte foundation like a fully completely matte foundation foundation so i'm using matte and polis which is also got spf 22 in it so i'm in the shade 126 and i will only focus on the defective areas problematic areas of my face which is absolutely the under eye line so I'm gonna go blend everything with my fingers first. I have recently got a really heavy lap circle. I don't know for what reason I'm sleeping. All I'm doing is like sleeping and eating and like binge watching this thing. And I'm using my Age Rewind Concealer. I'm in the shade Medium. Also guys, what you guys are up to. So right now, I am watching Euphoria. Yes, I've been like wanted to watch Euphoria since so long guys. Because of Maddie and Cassie, everything that is going on online all the memes and everything that is going on online i have always wanted to watch that guys i mean that is like the most fucked up show like i've ever watched in my entire life like seriously it's like such a fucked up show like everyone is mentally sick there and everyone is like a teenager it's like a teenage series and oh my god you guys could like can relate to it if you have watched euphoria like what the fuck everyone is a teenager and everyone is like mentally retarded everyone is like mentally fucking sick someone is doing drugs someone is like planning to get babies planning to have babies someone is cheating with their best friend's boyfriend and like oh my god it's like so much going on you guys and like, season one was like really boring but season two is it's good it's spicy it's giving me drama it's like a little bit of like a pain and ass for me to watch because how the fuck are you so depressed at the age of 18 yes, everyone is depressed and everyone is crying i think it's just the world it is how it is right now you guys i don't know i'm like so blessed that i did not live a li life like that when i was a teenager like we didn't know much about mental illness and we didn't know much about stuff like drug like addiction and stuff like that you know what i'm saying so the more the more the world is getting to know about these things but i feel like the more you get to know about something the more your brain is tricks you i feel like that like the more we know about things the more we seem to like attract those things into our life because we think about those things research about those things post it online about those things a lot so it's very important to be like strong in this generation i feel like because the show that i'm watching that fucking show guys oh my fucking god it's like Sometimes it just pisses me a lot, but then I'm getting to know a lot with that show because God, that Cassie bitch. Like, if you have watched Euphoria, let's just chat about it. I just hate that bitch. Every time that bitch is like coming in into my screen, I'm like, fuck this bitch. I don't want to watch this bitch. I'm like skipping. Like, oh my God. The only character I fell in love with is Rue. I really like Rue's character and oh my God, Zendaya's acting, guys. If you haven't watched Euphoria, I would not suggest that you go and watch it because it's like a little pathetic. But if you are like, bored, if you are someone who supports art, then you should go ahead and watch it because oh my god the acting skills that that bitch has got Zendaya fuck so fucking good like each and every actor that it's so good acting wise in that show but otherwise that show is like pretty fucked up I would tell you guys pretty fucked up 
वेरी 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 नला बेरोजगार ह्यूमन बींग लाइक मी ओनली कैन वॉच दिस शो लाइक बिंज वॉच आर ओनो सो आई अप्लाइड कंसीलर इफ यू डू नॉट वॉन्ट टू डू नॉट अप्लाई कंसीलर दैट्स ओके ऑल्सो आई एम नॉट अपलाइंग मेकअप इन दिस पार्ट ऑफ माई फेस ऑल्सो आई एम नॉट बी फिलिंग द एंटायर ब्राउ बिकॉज केमिकल आई कैनॉट पुट इट इन हियर इन शुड वी यूज लाइक कॉन्टोर शुड वी लाइक शुड वी नॉट आई थिंक इज गन बी लाइक अ लॉट सो वे गन स्किप कॉन्टोर आई एम गोइंग टू सेट माई face when maybelline's compact is a very mattifying compact guy baking technique my og baking technique that i use always so i'm going to put it very roughly you don't need to be like very precise while putting it can you see the difference it's in front of you i'm going to like let that powder sit in for a while sit in for like few seconds let my skin soak the powder in for few minutes or second according to your skin type and then i'm going to go with the same sponge and not going to dust the powder off i'm going to push the powder back into my skin and i'm going to take the same sponge and roll it over everywhere my hair guys oh my god i'm like so sick of my hair <sighs> okay eyebrow time so i'm going to quickly go and do my eyebrows off camera because who want to watch a bitch doing her eyebrows that's hell boring fuck <laughs> click click my eyebrows what the fuck are they because of this wound i just cannot fill the entire brow and that's why they look like so different with my shitty fucking phone i just described everything about this i look like talk to you guys so much and this fucking phone decided not to record please subscribe to my channel so i can buy a new camera please thank you yeah so for i look i'm going to take memories and loyal from the palette and i'm gonna use it as my transition you can say transition but i'm gonna basically put it all over my lid you can take any light shade color similar to those okay so what were we talking about anyways let's just talk about just the show not about anything else but um yeah that show like i hated that cassie bitch guys i don't know about you guys if you have like watched euphoria let's just have a conversation below like what the fuck is that bitch up to like oh my god every she is just crying for no reason she's just playing the victim card and i hate people who just play as victim card and they don't know shit in their life they would do everything wrong in their life and they would act like a victim and all innocent and all like a saint you do not understand for what reason she acts like all the uh, sweet angel but then bitch you you fucked your best friend's man This loyalty 101, bitch. Like, what the fuck? You do not do that. Even if it's her ex, you do not do that. I'm taking Connect from the palette, guys. I'm mixing Connect with Touch actually, and I'm putting it on the outer corner. And next up, I'm using Reveal from the palette. It's a very lavenderish kind of a shade, guys. If you've got any lighter shade, like a whitish kind of a shade, you can use that as well. If you got like a white kajal or something like that, you can put it in your lower waterline. I do not have a white kajal, so I'm gonna use the whitest shade from the palette. We are almost done with the eye look. Mascara time. Shall we apply lashes or shall we not? If you want to, you can apply like mascara. Mascara and trust me, guys, it's so good. Like it's so good. My lash. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna focus on the outer corner only. Outer corner only. So that will give me like a foxy eye kind of a look. Okay, next up we are gonna go for a little blush. You can go for like cream bronzer or anything like that. But cream bronzers, गर्मी में humid temperature में मुझे जरा भी सूट नहीं करता. तो I try to use as much as powder products as I can. So I'm using a peachy shade. Wow, I love a good blush. Like I love to look like a tomato. Time for some setting spray. Or highlighter. I'll only use highlighter on the bridge of my nose. Okay, time for some lippy stick. My impatient bitches. Ah, that is the base makeup all in together. It doesn't matter we are using nude or not. We are going to overline the fucking crap out of our lips. So, for lipstick, I've got like two options. I think I'm gonna go with Maybelline, and I'm in the shade Save Dark Dress. Very stupid name they've given. Okay, guys. Again, my shitty phone stopped recording, so I didn't stop there. Like after using Maybelline's lipstick, I did not stop there. I used a uh, Just Herbs uh, lipstick, and in the shade Beetroot Burgundy, just a little bit, like little taps here and there. This is like my final look. This was my take on summer makeup look, you guys. But I would not say that this is like a bulletproof makeup, and you can get out in the sun and totally sweatproof. Like, no. What the fuck is a summerproof makeup in India? 
nothing like it's literally 100 degrees outside it's literally it's literally 45 degrees right now i'm sitting here in 45 degrees and like bloody filming guys and still this face looks like this like it's like kudos thode thode efforts dal sakte hai ki hamara makeup thoda last long kare i have also worn this makeup in calcutta you guys and it stayed for a decent amount of time so trust me it's gonna stay if you use the techniques and tricks that i told you to like use i think it looks pretty decent i'm sitting without ac just a fan jiska hawa pata nahi kahan ja raha hai bhai jo kya pankha hai ye ka but still it's looking pretty decent i feel like so yeah that's that a little disclaimer i'm gonna go do my hair फटाफट और मैं फटाफट वापस आती हूँ ठीक है फक मी गाइज लाइक आई सू वेर इट्स सो फकिंग हॉट एन यर लाइक ओ माई गॉड गाइज इज लाइक लिचली सो फकिंग हॉट टू डोज टू मी दर आई एम सिटिंग यर एंड फिल्मिंग दिस वीडियो माई हेयर इज लाइक टोटल डोरा एंड आई एम नॉट इन अ मूड टू लाइक फिक्स द हेयर और एनीथिंग लाइक दैट बिकॉज इज लाइक टोटल डोरा गाइज डजन मैटर वॉट आई डू टू दिस हेयर दिस हेयर इज नॉट गन गेट फिक्सड बट या आई रियली होप दैट यू गाइज इंजॉय द वीडियो इज द थर्ड टाइम आई एम फिल्मिंग द आउट रो गाइज इज फकिंग फोन डेड नॉट रिकॉर्ड एनी थिंग सब्सक्राइब कर दो तुम लोग चैनल को और लाइक कर देना ताकि मैं अपना जॉब छोड़ सकूँ और और इसे अपना परमानेंट जॉब बना सकूं और एक अच्छा सा सुंदर सा अपार्टमेंट लेके मैं एसी वेसी लगा के आराम से बैठ के फिल्म कर सकूं ठीक है और अपना जो यूफोरिया वाला कॉन्वर्सेशन चल रहा था लेट्स कंटिन्यू दैट कॉन्वर्सेशन इन द कमेंट सेक्शन बिलो आई कैच यू इन माय नेक्स्ट वीडियो ट्रस्ट मी आई एम रियली वेरी फोकिन टायर्ड लाइक आई एम टायर्ड एज फॉक गाइज अब ये ताम झाम मिटाना है मुझे कैन यू लाइक फॉकिंग बिलीव इट एनी बाय मुझे अब एसी का सुख लेने दो थोड़ा लव यू